All right, students, welcome to October 16, 2020. Um, today, what we're going to do is explain how the dead zone has impacts on society and identify how dead zones form. You're turning in today your dead zone vocabulary, comic strip, dead zone questions from the Wall Street Journal. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and open up the agenda and go through the agenda really quickly. I already have it open, but you would have to click on the link. Here is the agenda for today. Remember that the cutoff for late work was last Thursday. I noticed that some people were still turning in work as of yesterday. I'm sorry, but that work is not going to get graded. Don't forget to bring in <clears throat> a plastic two liter bottle by Friday of next week. Daily quiz two times are here. Google meet times are here. All right, so we're on class starter number two. Be sure to complete that. So today's assignment starts here. We're gonna write on page 48, the anchor phenomenon. And our driving question is, what are the causes and effects of the Gulf of Mexico dead zone? After you finish that, we're going, I'm giving you time to finish the Wall Street Journal that's due today. Here are the questions that go with it. Once you're finished with that, then you're going to open this document, watch the video, answer the questions. Once you're done, go to this National Geographic article and then you will answer these two questions here on page 48 of your notebook. Then what you'll do is you'll launch a Nearpod. Here's, this should take you straight to it, but if it doesn't, this is the join code if it asks. And here's the exit ticket. Once you're finished with that, catch up on any missing work for this week. So by the end of class today, you will have completed class starter number two, daily quiz number two. Finish the questions and turn them in from the Wall Street Journal article. The two dead zone activities, the National Geographic article and questions, your Nearpod and exit ticket, and then catch up on any missing work if you have time. Here is a week of all, here is a recap of all of the work that we did this week. I just put it all in one spot for you. All right, our closing quote, your mind is like a factory. The ingredients you're putting into it will be used to make the final product, which is your life. Watch what you are feeding your mind. Positive in and positive will come out. If you put negative in, then negative will come out. Start speaking life order things that you want to see happen in your life. If you have a spare moment, look up the law of attraction and what it means. I think you'll find it to be very interesting. All right, so that is a recap of everything that you're supposed to be working on. All right, thank you and happy learning.